Welcome back friends and today I'd like to go over the Tai Chi move called fly obliquely or flying obliquely A few things to remember is that when you're opening the arms, you're opening up the chest cavity. Therefore, you want to open up your lungs. So you want to inhale. And then when you bring in your arms in, you're closing your chest. So you want to exhale and let the air out of your lungs. And your intent, your intent, and your focus should be at the index finger of your hand that's opening up. So again. And you want to work in unison with your leg and your hand, meaning that when you step out, you don't want to, or you don't want to already be out, and then bring your hand up like this. You don't. You, this is what you don't want to do. So what you want to work on is being in sync. So I'll go this way so you can see a different ver different way. And like I say, focus on your index finger. This is where a lot of the action is going to be here. And be sure to bend your knee and your leg so you can you can be more stable and have have your balance when you're stepping and you can have a, a little bit of lean but you don't want to obviously lean too much because that's going to throw your balance off. So I'll face one more time. I'll face the camera so you can see. And there you have it friends, fly obliquely. And we'll go over the application for this later on in, in, a, in a different video. So a few things to remember again is to make sure your knees are bent so you can help, so it'll help with your balance and your intent, your focus needs to be on the leading hand index finger. So if 
your right hand is the leading hand, you're going to want to focus on the tip of the index finger. And your breathing is, like I say, when, you ex when your arms are opening up, you want to inhale. And when your arms are closing, you want to exhale. So fly obliquely. And until next time, friends, have a great day.